Hello everyone. So here I'm going to solve by row equivalent matrix method. So let's take a start. Here we have to find out the value of x and y by using row equivalent matrix method. Let's start. The augmented matrix is just we have to write down the coefficient of x and y what is the coefficient of x 2 so we have to write here 2 coefficient of y is 5 so 5 we have to write and here constant number 12 after this coefficient of x is 5 so we have to write here 5 coefficient of y is minus 2 so we have to write minus 2 and here constant number 1 so we have to write here 1 after this what we have to do we have to convert in the form of 1 0 0 1 and here we have to write we get constant number this one is value of x this one is value of y so this we have to convert in the form of 1 here 0 here 0 and here 1 so this is equivalent sign how to convert this in the form of 1 we have to divide by 2 when you divide by row 1 when you divide by 2 we get 1 we need one here so first we have to convert this then this then this then this so let's divide we get here one here we get here five by two and here we get 12 by 2 means 6 the second one we have to write on same second row we have to write on same after this we need here zero first this one then this one then this then this now how to get zero we have to multiply one by five and we have to subtract so we get here zero so let's multiply row one by five and we have to subtract from this row 1 write on same 1 5 by 2 and here 6 now row 1 we have to multiply by 5 and we have to subtract here um, 5 into 1 5 and we have to subtract from here 5 minus 5 we get here 0 this multiplied by 5 what we get here 25 by 2 and we have to subtract here so what we have to do here minus 2 minus 25 by 2 2 to the 4 minus 29 by 2 so we have to write minus 29 by 2 here also we have to multiply by this 5 5 6 are 30 and from 1 minus 30 we get here minus 29 what we done here r2 tends to r2 minus 5 r1 and here we done r1 1 by 2 r1 we divided r1 by 2 after this equivalent to now next what we have to do one zero zero one now we need here one to get one what we have to do we have to multiply by two by twenty nine minus two by twenty nine when you multiply by minus two by twenty nine we get here one so one five by two six zero when you multiply like this minus twenty nine by two into minus two by twenty nine this this cancel this this cancel minus minus plus so here we get one this also multiply so what we get here minus twenty nine into two by twenty nine minus two by twenty nine this this cancel this this cancel what we get here two so we have to write here two okay what we done here r two tends to minus two two by twenty nine r two now one zero zero uh, one and here we need zero how to convert this in the form of zero r2 we have to multiply by 5 by, uh, 5 by 2 and we have to subtract so if we get here 5 by 2 and when you subtract from r1 we get 0 so let's multiply 1 plus 0 1 2 multiply this by 5 by 2 and subtract from 5 by 2 in, into 0 means 0 so when you subtract we get same one here 5 by 2 when you multiply 1 by 5 by 2 we get 5 by 2 when you subtract we get here 0 multiply this 5 by 2 when you multiply 5 by 2 2 into 5 by 2 this is cancel we get here 5 so 6 minus 5 we get here 1 now you can see this is in the form of identity matrix so what we get here what is the value of x 1 so we can write x is equal to 1 and y is equal to 2 is the answer hope you understand this video if you understand please hit the like button and if you are new on my channel please consider subscribe and do not forget to hit the bell button to get notification of upcoming videos too thanks for watching till last keep supporting and keep sharing with your friends